It was a shocking scene. A young father found shot in his car and left to die in an alley. Now, almost seven years later, his family's still desperate to catch his killer. They want to make sure he is never forgotten. News Channel 5's Emily Luxon explains how you can help Metro Police solve this cold case and provide answers for a grieving family. And these are our school pictures. Him and his cousin. Cheryl White has nothing but fond memories of her nephew, Denzel Tyler. We talk about him daily, constantly daily. Yes, like he's still here. Yeah. Known as Denny, the 24-year-old Nashville native loved his family and friends and was a proud father to his two-year-old daughter. And this is his little sister. Cheryl says he was attending MTSU we, and had a bright future ahead of him. His life was short, yeah, taken by someone that obviously don't value anybody's life. Yes. On November 7, 2016, around 5.30 in the evening, Metro Police found Denzel in the driver's seat of his SUV in an alley behind Claiborne Street. He had been shot in the chest and died at the scene. There was a pistol found laying on the ground nearby. That gun was determined to have been the gun that killed him, and it was registered to him as well. When family members learned what happened, they were shocked. I asked his friends, I asked my son, he was like, I don't know anybody that would have done that to him. As Metro Police work to find out who killed Denzel and why, they are asking for the public's help. They hope someone will come forward with information on what happened to him. Just to even give a description of a vehicle that was seen leaving the area or a person running away from the scene would be helpful. Denzel Tyler! I don't understand how people can walk around day to day knowing they killed somebody. And it's, it's okay for them. Cheryl says her family deserves answers and they aren't giving up. I cannot believe we are almost seven years in and we don't have any clues. While the heartbreak will never go away, finally finding the person responsible for Denzel's death would bring some peace. We need closure. We want closure. I need closure for my sister because she's having a rough time. Until that closure comes, Denzel's family will always treasure the time they had together. Emily Luxon, News Channel 5. So if you have information that can help investigators find out who killed Denzel, you can call Crime Stoppers or Metro Police. You can see both numbers right there on the screen. You also can remain anonymous.